Welcome back to Wayne State Fieldhouse as we sit down with Nick Oresco, Canton, Michigan's own Nick Oresco, uh, business operations coordinator this year, but he's held multiple positions in the organization, account manager in year one, ticket sales coordinator in year two. It's kind of what it's all about in the G League, right? You're grinding, you're making waves. How's it going in this organization? You've been here since day one. Give us your overview as to where this organization's at now. Yeah, Chad, you said it best. Um, this is a fantastic place to, you know, start a career and continue to build a career within this industry. But, you know, been here since the start with the Motor City Crews and have shown the progression every year moving forward, which has been fantastic. And we're doing really good things where we can continue to grow, um, not only per personally, but uh, within the organization as a collective whole. But you know, we saw a lot of success year one, uh, and we saw a lot of success year two, but year two, we were able to find ways to improve our business plan overall. And now year three, we're kind of seeing those results play out in real time. Uh, so it's been fun so far, but just the journey itself has been great to go from one job to the next and to the next now. So uh, things are good. It's a great league to develop your skills and uh, keep pushing forward, you know. This is a uh, position that helps when you're winning, helps when there's success Absolutely. on the court. Absolutely. Uh, we've seen this this year. It kind of reminds you of year one, Jeez. I would imagine. Talk about this team and how exciting it is to be in your position with a team that's playing so well. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I mean, it's it's fantastic that we're off to a hot start. You know, five and two, you can't really beat it right now. We're at the top of, of the G, so that's great. Uh, a lot of mo momentum moving forward into the Showcase Cup, which we're excited about. But, uh, you know, when this team's good, you know, we're feeling good collectively as an organization, and that helps promote uh, this team within this town. Uh, obviously, we have a lot of big sports organizations within this town that we're competing against, so this is just a great story to tell when uh, we do have the success on the court, and we're looking forward to more success, but I think uh, Coach McMillan's got the boys playing really well. Uh, ben Carloni's done a great job assembling this roster, so uh, things are looking good on the court. We're hoping to pick it up, and uh, we're just going to continue to ride the momentum on the business side to, to reach our goals, so everything's good right now. On the business side and the marketing side specifically, I know you have theme nights yeah. that are planned, and it's always a fun night to bring the family, bring friends out uh, when there's something it's it's themed around. Talk about some of the cool theme nights that we can expect this year. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, so we have some big ones coming up. We have a Code 313 takeover night, uh, which is actually going to be tomorrow night, Friday, December 1st. It's a nonprofit organization within the city is going to come. Uh, and do a lot of STEM activations, which can be a lot of fun. We have our education games coming up. Uh, we bring out a bunch of Detroit public schools uh, to enjoy some fun activations as well as watch a, a basketball game. Uh, and then we're going to have our Hoops for Troops night coming up, our Breast Health Awareness game coming up in March too. So some things to look forward throughout the rest of the season. And like I said, if we can continue the success on the basketball side, it's going to help with these theme nights continue to grow and make sure we give really good fan attendance for these guys playing on the court. Nick, it's been awesome getting to know you and everything that you've done for the organization. Keep grinding, keep going, and uh, keep doing great work. Looking yeah. forward to all the theme Absolutely. nights. Absolutely. I appreciate it. Thanks. All right, there he is, Nick Oresco, the Motor City Crews. Business ops coordinator doing great things, though, from day one when this organization started two short years ago. We're at halftime of the Herd and the Crews from Wayne State Fieldhouse. More basketball and analysis from Reg coming up right after this. This is Crews Basketball. 